Good morning. This is Angela from North Carolina, and you were looking at a taco dog. I'm fixing to make a taco dog, and it came about by accident. You know how you'll be in the mood for a hot dog, and you won't have any buns, so you have to change up with something else for dinner? Well, our family accidentally didn't have buns one night. And decided to use a taco shell, soft tortilla. And it was the best thing you've ever had. And I have hot dog buns in the freezer. But I'm not going to use them because I don't think I'll ever use a hot dog bun. Hot dogs originally were kind of the big thing in the barbecues way back in the 40s and 50s. Because the adults would eat their steak and their prime rib. And then they would have the kids eat a hot dog. And they found out real quick that it was better to have lots of bread. They didn't eat as many hot dogs. Because if you've ever noticed, <laughs> one hot dog feels to me like it's like I'm eating two sandwiches. And it's so messy. I end up, if I'm at a cookout, with it on my chin and my clothes. This is a veggie dog. So what I'm doing right now... I already cooked it in water. Some people prefer to microwave. I'm not a microwaver. So I lightly am frying it. I always lightly fry my veggie dogs or any hot dog, turkey, if I make one for someone, because it makes it taste like a real hot dog after it's been microwaved. And the veggie dogs get kind of wet uh, feeling, like a Vienna sausage when you boil them. So I have my mustard on my flour tortilla. It's cold. I have some cream, the creamy, uh, creamy milk, and I sprinkle a little cheese. Now, of course, my husband eats his differently. He likes his with hot dog, coleslaw, mustard, and onions, but I don't feel like making coleslaw, and this is my favorite way, is with a little bit of cheese. I've got olive oil cooking with my hot dogs. They're getting bubbled up. So, I'm not going to put the tortilla in the microwave. I'm going to put these hot hot dogs right on top of the cheese. Ready? See how they're right there? Hot. And my cheese is melting. Now, here comes my onion and jalapeno. Yes, I'm putting onion and jalapeno on my hot dog. <laughs> I love it. On my veggie dog, and I'm going to spread that out. It does not matter how much food you put inside of this hot dog. Nothing falls out. This is the perfect thing for children old people, when you're having to eat riding in the car. But anyway, I just had to show you my taco dog. These are extra long hot dogs, vegetable dogs. They're a little bit harder. But I'm just going to fold it up. And as you can see, I am ready to go. So welcome to the world of taco dogs. Enjoy it. Bye.